Hello and welcome to this week's Warriors HQ. Coming up, highlights from our game against Leinster, plus reaction from Rob Harley, and we also catch up with scrum half Nemia Kenitali. Glasgow Warriors beat Leinster 33-25 here at Scotston on Saturday. Here's the best of the action, plus reaction from Rob Harley. This is tight, but it still is. Burgos has it again. Now it's really starting to open up, and Burfisi's coming on the charge. Well, they enjoyed that. Quick ball here, could be decisive. Hoff going wide again, and here's a chance for Seymour. Lends the defence again for the second time in the match. Swinson! He's done exactly that. Terrific tempo. It's solid. Two coverage. Give it away. He's made a mistake. Puts his hands to his head. Warrior down. Seymour's off again. Oh! Seymour! Under the pass! What a spell for Seymour and Glasgow. And we're driving, we're driving just to get it out. Burgos, and then it is Seymour! So Rob, um, here you are in front of the fans, sell out today at Scotston, how was that for you? Um, it was really good, kind of, we had, had big support from the start, a lot of noise and uh, especially a new pitch, it was great to have that energy behind us because um, it's so fast that uh, you know, when it helps playing attacking rugby but it does mean that kind of, it's going to test teams to the limit because the game's so fast and that, that told at the end with the pressure we were able to exert as the match went on. Um, it's a really good start for us, especially with the, the bonus points. Um, and we have played some good rugby, but there's, there's a long way to go and there's a lot for us to work on. Um, so we're going we're gonna to keep our feet in the ground, kind of analyse what we've got to do and hopefully kind of we know we can still improve and that we've got you know, several steps to go to, to be a better team than we were kind of last year and in these games. And then four tries from Tommy Seymour. How good was he today? Um, I think that's about as many tries I've had for Glasgow in, in my career, so he, he wasn't bad. Uh, just... Um, just absolutely electric. I think that's that's uh, another thing with the new pitch that with the pace we have on the backs, guys like Tommy, Hoggy, uh, Leo, are just gonna are just gonna get that space. And once they once they hit a half break like Tommy did today, he's taken it all the way to the post. So unbelievable performance from Tommy. And I think that's hopefully that's the new norm for what we've got this season. Here's a time lapse video of our new artificial pitch being installed over the summer. Stay at least down till the sun goes down. When you're gone, I lose faith, I lose everything I have found. Hot strings, violence, that's what I hear when you're by my side. Ooh. Yeah, that's what I hear when you're by my side.
This week we spoke to our new Fijian scrum half, Nemia Kinitali. Nemia, welcome to Glasgow Warriors. Uh, how have you settled in? Uh, at the moment I've been, uh, to be honest, like I've been settling well in, for like a few, a few weeks time. I've been here a few days ago. So the environment is good and I've been like, uh, the boys are very good. Um, yeah, they're friendly. Uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it at the moment. Has it been a lot for you to take in the early stages of your <coughs> Warriors career? Uh, yeah, especially the game plan. Like, I've uh, been new to this environment for, for, the, for, uh, for, the, for, the, for this new season. So, yeah, a lot to take in, a lot, a lot, a lot to learn from uh, like in a few days, in a few weeks' time. I think I'll be like, in a great stage. How much has Gregor Townsend helped you in the sort of last few weeks? Yeah, uh, Gregor is a very he's a, like experienced coach in here in Glasgow, and also like Mike Blair is uh, my help helping me, so I'm especially in passing the halfback skills. So we have a lot, a lot to learn here in Glasgow. So yeah, going to be a great time here. Yeah, you just talked about Mike there. He's obviously retired now, but he's got a big part to play in the coaching team and helping players like yourself. Yeah, experienced players like Mike, and he's been here for in playing in Scotland. So I've been learning more from him. And yeah, what a great player because I, I watch, uh, love watching him on the TV when he played for Scotland. So yeah, I'm happy to be, uh, I'm happy Mike coaching me for the halfback skills. Yeah. How much are you looking forward to playing in the Guinness Pro 12 and the European yeah. Rugby Champions Cup uh, this yeah, season? Yeah, depending on uh, uh, whether coach like have faith in me, if I have some opportunity game time, so like uh, uh, prove myself. So. Because we have competition, like we have five uh, halfbacks, few five, uh, five halfbacks at the moment. So there's going to be a great uh, opportunity if I take on whatever games. Yeah. Have you watched a lot of Glasgow Warriors footage from previous seasons? Do you like the way that Glasgow Warriors <coughs> like to play rugby? <coughs> yeah, I like the way they're playing. Uh, like the, their fast, fast game. They like fast game, so uh, uh, that's why they win the. That uh, last season, or last two season, that uh, the way they play. Uh, so I've been watching some of the clips on YouTube before I came. So, oh yeah, it's gonna be okay when I start to copy. Now, of course, we've had some Fijian players here in the past. Nico Matawalu, who I believe you you've spoken to about the club. Yeah, I, was, I spoke to Nico before I came in. Uh, so he already explained to me the environment. And uh, the players, the boys. So yeah, I've been like knowing what uh, to expect when I come in. So yeah, that's why Nico and Leone uh, were there for me. They like uh, s uh, talked to me, uh, saying some advice to me. So before I came in Glasgow. So yeah. Did that help you decide to come to Glasgow? The fact that Fijian players have been here, like Leone, like Nico, that have settled in and, and been successful. Yeah, that's why uh, like. When uh, the coach approached me, that's uh, when I say when I hear Glasgow. So yeah, was Fijian player came here and they are like uh, being successful when they can they can come to Glasgow. So yeah, there's a big uh, a big shoes to fill here when I came here so because Nico and Leone have been like famous here a few seasons ago. So yeah, it's gonna be a great challenge for me. And the supporters will be very excited to see you. Are you looking forward to running out at Scotstone Stadium for the first yeah, time? Yeah, they're going to be excited like for the first time. It's a great crowd when I see watch some footage, uh, footage on, the, on TV. So, yeah, I'm going to be excited when I go, come uh, if there's an opportunity for me in Scotstone. That's all for this week. We'll see you next Wednesday at 5 on Warriors TV.